Hey everybody, it's Phil with Behringer. How are you doing today? Welcome to Music Group Studios. I want to talk to you today about the Virtualizer 3D, which is also called the FX2000. So the FX2000 is like having a whole guitar pedal board or effects rack from a studio right in a one unit piece of gear. And it's really cool because it does so many things. It's got reverbs and delays and choruses, so it has all the gain pitched time stuff in there. It has uh, amplifier simulation and all kinds of psychoacoustics. So the way it works is there's 71 different algorithms that you can choose from and yet you can store these in a hundred different locations. So let's talk about some of the algorithms and things. The FX2000 uses real sound modeling so it'll get you everything from straightforward delay to like a real surreal kind of 3D kind of aspect thing going on which is going to be great live or in the studio. There's great modulation, dynamic, psychoacoustic and EQ algorithms built in that's going to give you a really huge sound and with different stereo and mono algorithms that are going to work together. It's really cool. Now you have 11 effect combinations you can choose from which can either be serial or parallel effects and you have seven different items that you can adjust per algorithm and you also get a two band EQ on each patch. You're going to have pristine sound because on the way in and on the way out the A to D converters and D to A converters are 24 bit. It's going to be nice and clean and it's also 64 to 128 times over sampling so you're going to have a nice great signal to apply all these effects to. Inside it is true stereo processing so it's not trying to make it processing, it is stereo processing which is going to give you a great stereo and 3D image. Now right out of the box you have a hundred factory presets to choose from which is going to cover a wide array of effects. Now as you're going through those hundred presets you can also store a hundred presets so if you find one you like you can change it a little bit, edit it and store it as your own. So you have a hundred factory presets and a hundred presets that you can make of your own. That's a lot of flexibility. Now on the back of the FX2000 are MIDI ports and this means that you can have a lot of MIDI control of the patches and you can also do sysx dumps of your presets as well so that you can pull them up at any time via MIDI or from the front panel. Makes it nice. All of the inputs and outputs whether they're XLR or quarter inch are servo balance so you're going to get a great signal strength in and out of the unit. It's real important to have that. The VT4 is an effects processor for your voice. It can do a ton of cool stuff and I'm just going to show you how I use it in my setup. The first thing I really love about it is its ability to communicate uh, via MIDI and harmonize your voice. So I have it hooked up to the System 8 and I'm using this to give information to the VT4 to tell it what chords I want it to play. you can balance how much of the effect um, and how much of your natural voice is coming through. So if I wanted to be able to sing a line over the chords I'm playing and have that really be prevalent, I can just go ahead and turn the balance down and you'll be able to hear my voice coming through the harmony. What I love about this is that there are no menus. So everything is very tactile. What you see is what you get. Um, if you want to change something, it's as easy as you know turning this knob or removing the slider. So it's very intuitive and very easy to kind of create something really special live and not have to go through and program everything and have it all laid out beforehand. An effect I like to use a lot is the pitch shift. I like to use my voice as a bass, um, and I'm using this looper here, so it's really easy to kind of use my voice as all of the instruments. Um, so what I like to do is shift my voice all the way down an octave and then switch the formant to something warmer to give it a nice resonance and a nice beefiness. <laughs> I like to use the megaphone effect to give my voice kind of that lo-fi quality. Um, and the cool thing about all of these effects is that there are multiple versions of each one. So there's multiple megaphones, multiple types of harmonies and vocoder sounds. Um, so you can really be creative and really kind of customize every sound to your liking.
you can use these buttons up here to customize what type of effect is on the slider. So you can do a delay, a reverb, a chorus, um, whatever you want, you can change it to be exactly what you need. So I like taking multiple effects and combining them to create a really unique sound and then save it as a preset so that I have it when I want to go play. So I want to start with just a simple harmony. Cool, I like that. So now I want to add some space. So maybe I'll add a little bit of delay here. Now, let's say like while I'm performing, I want to do a cool pitch sweep or something. Um, I can easily do that with this fader over here. So now I have an effect that I'm happy with and I want to save it. All I have to do is come over here, press and hold a button, and it will save as a preset just like on your car stereo. Hi everyone, this is Samuel from Zoom, and I'm here to show you how to use the effects on the Zoom V3 vocal processor. The V3 is a powerful tool packed with effects, harmonizing options, pitch correction, and more. You can use the V3 to add effects to vocals for music, or to add voice effects for your podcast or live stream. Let's start by taking a look at the main effects section on the V3. Here we see 16 creative voice effects that can be adjusted with the parameter knob below. You can select one of these effects to use at a time. When using the harmony, talkbox, vocoder, or pitch correct effects, you can select the key being used. For pitch correction, you also have a chromatic option. The harmony effect will allow you to add up to two voices to create a three-part harmony in both major and minor keys. Select your desired voices with the harmony style buttons. I never experienced anything like this before. Maybe because when do 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 do. The rest of the effects will add their own unique sound to your voice. This is your man Aaron B. with a word from our portal to the inner earth of fine fashion, the folks at Blake's Fine Men's Clothiers. Use the effect off button to bypass all of the processing. While only one of the 16 button effects can be engaged at a time, the compressor, delay, and reverb can always be engaged using their independent control knobs to adjust the amount of the effect. The compressor will even out the volume of your voice so every word can be heard and the delay and reverb are basic vocal effects used commonly on any performance. There's also a built-in enhance button for increased sound clarity that can be used in conjunction with any effect. That was a look at how to use the effects on the V3 vocal processor. Hi, I'm Laura Davidson, and today I'm going to be talking to you about the Boss VE8 Acoustic Singer. It's a compact, all-in-one preamp and vocal effects solution for singers who play the acoustic guitar. Let's start with the vocal side of the pedal. It comes with a great feature called Vocal Enhance. And what this allows you to do is get your voice out in front of the mix where it needs to be. So let me play an example of what the pedal sounds like with it off and on so you can hear what a big difference it makes. Now, 
if you want to go one step further and actually correct the pitch of your voice, that's in there as well. So there's a chromatic pitch corrector, meaning you don't ever have to set a key. It's going to follow right along and get your voice perfectly in tune. But if you wanted to push the envelope a little bit, there's also hard tune pitch correction in there as well. Also included in the VE8 are a wide variety of vocal effects. So I'm going to step through a few of them now. This one's called doubling. Typically, it's an effect that's reserved for the studio because you would actually track your voice and then record the track again. Obviously, you can't do that live, but with the VE8, now you can, and it adds a nice thick sound to your chorus. So let's hear what that sounds like. He's six foot two, looks nothing like you. He's a medicine man from a broken heart. All my pain just disappeared. When he came to my rescue, I found a cure for you. In addition to doubling, there are also some great standard vocal effects like reverbs, which I have constantly going on my voice because I'm in love with reverb. And there are also some great more out there effects like an electronic voice, radio, distortion. So let's hear what some of those sound like. I'll give you a quick run through. You don't get to call me anymore. You don't get to tell me how you feel. Oh, that ship has sailed. That door's been locked for years. Oh, you don't know me, and I don't know you. But I know one thing for sure. I'm not. So that's the harmonies that you heard at the tail end. So in addition to great vocal effects, there's also two voices of harmony that you can add on the VE8. So you as the singer have the choice of having one voice, two voices, one above, one below. You really have a lot of freedom and flexibility, especially because it can track your guitar chords. So you never have to worry about setting a key. You just play, throw a capo on there, finger pick style, it doesn't matter. It's still going to track you. And you can also set the key if you want to have a specific fixed key throughout. So let's hear what those harmonies sound like. Give me all your love And I'll give you everything All I have in this world Oh, I'll lay it at your feet So beautiful sounding harmonies. You can have more female sounding if you go higher or high, and you can also have more male sounding voices if you use the low and lower. So that's the harmony side of the VE8 acoustic singer. So let's start to hear what some of the effects are that you can add to your guitar, starting with something called resonance, which isn't really an effect, but it does actually enhance the sound of your acoustic guitar's pickups. So if you have something that's not really sounding great when you plug it in, the resonance feature is going to actually enhance the sound of your guitar. So let's hear what it sounds like with it off and on a few times. That's the acoustic resonance feature. And again, it enhances the sound of your pickups. Let's hear some of the other effects that you can add. So I'm just going to play through an example here. You'll hear the resonance going throughout and some of the more extreme, like a phaser and a delay effect, as well as a chorus and just nice reverbs in there as well. And that brings me to the next section of the pedal, which is the looper. It's an 80 second recording time looper where you can actually loop the guitar and vocals independent of one another. So let's hear what a loop sounds like when you put it all together. Oh, 
he's never coming back. No, he's never coming back. No, he's never coming back. No, he's never coming back. Back to you. So that was an example of the looping functionality of the VE8. You can also control your guitar and vocal loops independently using an external foot switch. Also included in the box are 50 presets, and that's a combination of vocal and guitar effects that you can start using as soon as you plug it in. But should you decide that you want to change them like I did, it's really simple to just push and hold and store it, and that way when you go on to a gig, you can set it up to follow your set list and know that your effects are going to be right where you want them to be. And then also when you get out on that gig, you want to be able to know that you're going to have the right input and output options. There's a lot of flexibility with the VE8 Acoustic Singer. You can also plug in a USB so that you can record it. And there's also optional batteries. So if you don't have a power supply, which it comes with, then you can use batteries and you'll be set. That's the Boss VE8 Acoustic Singer. You guys ready? Ready to go? Ready to go. Yeah, man, let's do this. All right, all right. <laughs> <laughs> what the f-